Many Northern Michigan students will head back to school on Tuesday. And for parents who want that keepsake photo of the first day, today's Project You Pin will add an element of fun and have your picture looking sharp. 9 and 10's Kaylin Franks has more details. Hello, my friends. Project You Pin this week. Hard to believe it, but it is almost time to head back to school. And there's nothing more classic than a first day back to school picture year after year to see how much your child has grown and how much fun they're having as they head back to school. A little bit of sarcasm, but hey, the pictures is the picture is important. And today we are making an awesome prop. This is also a really fun way to get kids engaged as they get ready for the big day. This is going out to my friend Al. She's getting ready to go into second grade and I'm making this pin for her. It's a giant pencil. Get ready. I began by measuring out my eraser, or I'm using the red noodle for this. Use a serrated bread knife. It is the only way you will get through noodles pretty quickly. I'm going to simply just cut the top off and use it as an eraser. Then it's time for duct tape. Regular silver duct tape does the trick perfectly because, hey, it looks like the metal part of the eraser. Tape a couple times around to make sure that your eraser doesn't fall off. For lead, I'm using a stick. No. If you're super crafty, you could use chalk, and then this pencil really could write on the sidewalk. Next up, carefully use the knife to trim down the tip of the pencil. This is basically like sharpening it. However you like, you can do it. There's no right way or wrong way. Make sure you use a Sharpie marker to personalize your pencil. It's the only thing that won't bleed into the noodle and that will be permanent. I'm writing a simple back to school message, but you could choose to get creative with your child's name, grade, and teacher or whatever else comes to mind. Maybe there wouldn't be so many sad faces on the first day back to school if you had one of these to pose with for your picture. Join me next week for another Project Soup Pin. A big thank you to Stone Edge Gardens just outside of East Jordan for having us. I'll see you next week.